Good morning, guys. Today we're gonna to be talking about how I make my coffee. Let's get started. I like to warm up my water inside the kettle. It makes noises when it's ready. And then I use a French press. This one's particularly made by this company called Bodum. I put three scoops of coffee. I use MCT oil. You can get this at Amazon. It's great for your brain and body fuel. Gia butter. Tablespoon of that. Tablespoon of that. And a tablespoon of cacao powder. And it tastes amazing. So this is how I make my morning coffee. My wife and I absolutely love it. Here we go. Three scoops. It's pretty straightforward. I used to do one. It was just way too watered down. So I've been doing... I've been doing three. And I will tell you that um, the coffee I'm using, I used to use the Bulletproof coffee, but I just find that I can, I like to mix it up so I don't get bored. This one's from um, Starbucks, as you can see. And I recently just bought a new bag from Costco, which has more, and just make sure that the coffee is grinded. I've tried both. I've tried grinding my, my coffee beans as well as uh, just buying the, gr the grinder already. And I found that I get more if I just buy it already grounded um, or grinded. I believe it's called grounded, but anyway. Uh, there you go. And then so the next step is adding the water. And I'm going to show you how I do it. because Maybe everybody does it a little bit differently. But I raise the water to about one-third off of the, uh, the top. Then I let it sit there and brew for about five minutes so that the, uh, the grounds get really grounded so I have to go like an angle there and you can kind of see there's a kind of a point in the front to match that point for spilling <clears throat> and I push it down about half ways this is your plunger right there and then you push it down by half ways there you go and just let it sit there for about five minutes our five minutes are up our next step is press this all the way down and I pour it into my blender. If you have a favorite French press, feel free to comment below and let me know. Next step is one tablespoon of Gia butter. I find it easier to use a spoon sometimes, but. This works too. Stick it into the coffee and it should melt it. One tablespoon of MCT oil. One tablespoon of Viva Cacao. This stuff right here, guys, is amazing. This flavor, tell you what, Makes a difference in the in the coffee for sure. Blend it and it's ready to serve. That smells good. The goonies never say die. Enjoy.